Let's do a thought experiment. Close your eyes and picture a sustainable building. What are you thinking of? A sparkling new building with solar panels? Wind turbines? Maybe building materials like bamboo or recycled plastic? Do you picture a building like this? This masonry building in Kansas City was built in 1914. Then it was a coal-fired power plant. Over the years, Kansas City grew and changed. They didn't need a coal-fired power plant anymore, so the building was abandoned. The buildings around it were torn down and new ones put up. But in 2011, that brick building was restored. Now it is a center for the arts in a thriving community. After 100 years, the building is still going strong. How long a building lasts, how resilient it is, that's important. After all, a building isn't very sustainable if in 10, 20, or even 30 years, you have to tear it down and build another one. One of the reasons why masonry buildings are so resilient is that as long as the building is still standing, the masonry can be cleaned and restored. Adaptive reuse of masonry buildings is gaining in popularity due to the environmental benefits of deep energy retrofitting existing buildings versus constructing entirely new buildings from scratch. So, an old school becomes an energy-efficient apartment building. An old factory becomes an upscale hotel. At Prosico, we have been at the forefront of restoring sustainable masonry buildings since before sustainability was a thing. So we know firsthand the resiliency of masonry. Think of churches and castles in Europe that date back to the Middle Ages. Heck, even the pyramids in Egypt are made of masonry. They've lasted for over 4,000 years. When we talk about sustainable buildings, let's talk about energy efficiency. Let's talk about smart use of natural resources. But let's also talk about resilient buildings that can stand the test of time. Find out more at prosico.com.